What is up guys, welcome back to another player review. Today we're going to be looking at a legend that is Van Nistelrooy, a very high rated legend, one of the highest rated, a 90 overall player. So, does he play like a 90 overall player? That's what we're going to find out in this video. But before I begin, if you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your coin, check out battelay.com. Their link will be in the description. Use the code Tony to get 5% off. Van Nistelrooy, Manchester United legend. Is he worth it? I think he goes for like four to five million coins, obviously on the 360 and the Xbox One. So to begin with, he has pretty good pace. I mean, you won't need more than 80 pace for your striker as long as he's he's quite strong and Vanistory is quite strong. But other than that, he he I don't know. I was expecting more from a 90 overall player. Anyway, I want to let you guys know that I did try changing the strike force in this team halfway through the review. I put Zola and Vieri, and every time I would cross it, Vieri would be the one to head it. Even though Van Nistelrooy is supposed to be, you know, a clinical finish in the area, he's supposed to be the one that I cross to, the target man. But Vieri keeps taking the spotlight, so I had to, you know, change Vieri around and try and make him not fucking head it in and not be the one to take the spotlight every single time so Van Nistelrooy really good finish in the penalty area sometimes I would miss in the penalty area but I think it, it's most likely my fault because this guy has really high finishing attributes but finishing wise I felt that they could be better in my opinion finish shot wise he's really good at them now his shot power is really high but his long shots from outside the area to be let me let me just summarize Van Nistelrooy the legend he is Really good in the penalty area, but outside the penalty area, he is pretty much useless. So if you want to do anything with him, you have to set him up completely inside the penalty area for him to score you a goal. Outside the penalty area, he cannot dribble. He has three star skills and three star weak foot, and he's also a quite a tall player. I think he's like six foot two or six foot three. So you want to cross it. He can be a good target man if you can find him in the penalty area, because sometimes he just doesn't like being in the penalty area. I think this has something to do with his work rates. Me medium attacking and low defending but he has really high attack positioning so you can find him um, you know finding his own space when you're not controlling him but a lot of the time he just doesn't want to make runs so that's another thing you have to keep in, keep in mind and just overall he just doesn't feel like a 90 overall player and I just felt that he wasn't really effective in matches so by far he has to be the worst legend I have tried out now don't get me wrong, he isn't a terrible player by any stretch of the imagination, just not as effective as the other legends I have tried out. He feels more like a normal player than a legend in this game, to be honest with you guys. The others, they felt like legends, they felt pretty special. Just like Vieri, um, Inzaghi, it's shaky as well, but uh, Van Story I felt was worse than Inzaghi, to be honest with you. So overall, um, just doesn't feel like a 90 overall player. I think that's the easiest way to summarize this whole review. Um, not really effective in matches, and that's all there is to it, guys. He's not terrible. He will get you goals, and he's a clinical finisher. Just not... Uh, just... If you're buying him, just don't expect too much from him. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. Let me know in the comment section below which legend you want me to review next. Still no Pele. I'm still in the search, still on the hunt for Pele. And um, I think he's going to be ultra rare. Let me know if you want to see a Maldini as a striker review in the comment section below. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you have a very nice day.